851, turn right, heading 180. Turn right, turn right, turn right, turn right, report Is the A330-800 dead? Will it attract any new customers? But most of all, are Airbus actually concerned about the lack of, well, absolutely no orders for the aircraft? I'm DJ's Aviation, and today that's exactly what I'll be shedding some light on. I hope you enjoy. The A330-800neo is an aircraft that is based off the current A330. It also has no orders. Quite odd when you think about it. The A330-800 does have another aircraft in its family, and that is the A330-900. This variant, while not being the most successful aircraft on the market, has just over 200 orders with more likely to be headed its way in the future. But let's not get too sidetracked. If an aircraft has zero orders, you'd usually think that may warrant a bit of stress from the manufacturer. This doesn't seem to be the case with Airbus. They are insisting that the A330-800 still has the opportunity to grow with it still being an attractive option for airlines. Do you believe this still to be true? I honestly don't know. I mean, in the past few weeks, despite Hawaiian Airlines cancelling their order for the aircraft, United and Indigo, who are quite large carriers in their respective nations and the world, have all noted that they are interested in the aircraft. In regards to the loss of the Hawaiian order, an Airbus spokesman said, you win some and you lose some. He went on to also say, there are many campaigns ongoing and there are many good candidates for the A330neos going forward. So it seems that Airbus are still oozing with confidence and believe there is a demand for both variants of the A330neo. The Airbus spokesman finally said both the A330-800 and 900 share the same final assembly line stations, tools and equipment, which allows for full flexibility according to market demand. What do you make of this? Do you truly think the A330-800neo is dead, or do you believe an order from a carrier like Indigo and United, who would undoubtedly order a large amount, could propel the aircraft forward in the future? Let me know by dropping your thoughts in the comment section below. I'd like to take the time now to thank you all very much for tuning into another one of my videos, and I hope to see you all in the next one. Peace.